Some people ask, is Wing Chun effective in modern self-defense situations? And just to answer, modern self-defense is actually no different from back when Wing Chun was invented. The only thing that's different is guns. And the technique you use to high handle it if it's on close distance is the same. So yes, it's the same scenario. To me, Wing Chun is the most effective self-defense system. And why? For different reasons. First of all, if anybody is a distance fighter, I can go and get a weapon. I can go and get a friend or I can leave. So the moment he makes distance, I have options to get away. That's the first thing. So distance fighting is more for sports or some kind of a duel. So if he's close enough that I can hit him on this distance in the scenario, we're in, the, in each other's face like this, at this start, I will be able to hit him and I'll be able to control him on this distance. And I know that he can, that he can grab on me, but understand, for me, if he's a grabber, he has to pass my distance. This is this one to grab on me. But I don't have to pass his grabbing, grabbing distance to strike him. So I know that he can grab on me. He will probably also try if I keep on hitting him and they can't avoid it. But I know this. So that's why. Wow. You have these options in a self defense scenario. The moment he moves away, what? You can move away. So. Self-defense wise, being really good at close fighting like on this distance here, that's the most ideal self-defense. And everything you train on distance and everything you train on the ground is not for real self-defense. Can you use it in some self-defense scenarios? Of course, but we're not talking about right or wrong, we're talking about ideal. And you want to specialize in what's going to be most likely, and most likely is right here. So nothing's right or wrong, but I think this is the most ideal.